This is an order of deployment. We've obtained a portion of classified intelligence concerning the enemy's heavy command cruiser from the Department of National Safety. The heavy command cruiser's official name has been identified as P-1112 Igion. The team consists of a mid-sized Kotos aircraft in charge of electronic warfare and a mid-sized Gyges aircraft in charge of close-range air defense. Igion, a command craft, takes care of all cruise missile-related duties. After acquiring this intelligence, we were able to draw up an operation to destroy the Igion. Listen closely. Fuel is added to the Igion through an opening located in the front. Multiple tankers must make their way to the front of the Igion for refueling purposes. Once the tankers are positioned in front of the craft to refuel it, the Igion's radar signals are temporarily weakened. This is where it gets important. While the Igion is being refueled, its radar is almost completely unable to detect any type of movement in front of the craft. If you can stay on course and maintain a certain altitude, you could approach the Igion from the air without being noticed by enemy forces. So our best chance of taking that monster out is during its mid-air fuel up. The Igion's flight schedule is also included in this piece of intelligence. We'll go over the flight route after our meeting in the hangar. Get prepared at once. should I pick? How about my weaponry? Are we ready to fly with these planes? Garuda team, time to take off. Stringing 2 to Igion. Patrol operation complete. Requesting permission to land. Providing ESM. You'll be in a world of hurt if you let them go. Oh, 
cockpit. The bastard's going down. Aerial battleship number one down. It's going down. Launching missile.
special weapons used. Careful now. The enemy has you on radar. Good job. The Igaion and its air unit have been destroyed. The cruise missiles aimed at Emeria have also been eliminated. This was a huge victory for us, and I'm sure it'll have a significant impact on the war. Garuda team, you have received a letter of commendation from the Joint Chiefs of Staff for your invaluable service in this mission. Tonight, you're free to do what you want. Lieutenant Colonel. This man was once a pupil of mine. Many years have passed since then, but Lieutenant Commander Pasternak still has that same spark of confidence in his eyes he had as a young man. Glad to see you are looking well. He was brought here to help you us too. turn the war in our favor. Now that he has been promoted to captain of the Strigan team, he is sure to be a thorn in the side of the Amerian military. Don't leave your baggage. It may be uncomfortable, but keep it hidden behind your back. Huh? Trust me, it is how things are done here. I asked him if he knew Garuda won. Know him? <laughs> My sole reason of being sent here was to fight him. He smiled to hide the rage within him. That should have been my passion, my fire. But things have changed. This man is about to step into the world I once knew. My days in the sky are behind me now. The bitter taste of loneliness is all I have left. <laughs> <laughs> 